now I just started playing Quattro today. I've been on Quattro for a total of 15 to 20 minutes. I have done this. This is all I have done. There is, and I don't, that would be him. 198 to 231. That guy does actually stand a chance at being Diamond. I did spook him out of here, but he is coming back. I think, I don't know if he's quite guaranteed Diamond, but he's going to hit right about that mark. So Diamond for Basi Ibex is actually 191. Last it was updated, so he actually is a guaranteed Diamond. But look at how big he is compared to the rest. I mean, that is a monster Ibex. I'm not sure what my biggest one is, but this is probably going to top that. And for anyone who's going to be like, well, you haven't played any Quattro, so it's probably going to definitely be your biggest. I, this is, you've got to remember, this is my account that I've started from scratch that we are, that we use for the channel stuff, so I do, I have played Quattro a lot before. So... He's, he's just going to come right back down. He is 4, so I can take him with the 7 mil. But to be honest, if he'll come in close enough... Ooh! Wind! I didn't even notice that. Okay, so we're probably not going to be able to do that. I was going to take him with the, the new rifle, but that's not going to work. Because he's not going to come in close enough for sure. Where's he even at? Like right around there last I checked. He's not going back up, is he? No, I don't think so. I think he's just in a spot where I can't really see him. He might be about to pop back out on this side if he is. Once he gets to this side of the tree, I think we're good to take him. It's just a matter of seeing him. I don't even see him anymore. Oh, that's him right there. Okay. Actually, if he'll keep coming like that, the reason I'm so nervous with it is just the goats are a little... Oh, he's going to walk straight. He's not going to turn. Ooh. We could be in a little bit of a situation with him. Yeah. Okay. This is kind of what I was worried about. And he's going to start to notice us soon, so let's go ahead and get this out. Just a little animal. I think we'll zero in for 75, actually. Right there. Yep. <gasps> I, I probably overcomplicated, overcomplicated that, but I just really wanted to go ahead and get that done with. He had me a little too nervous, especially knowing that he's guaranteed. If a C ibex, I think her, I think it's southeastern. Grado's Basit Ronda in terms of the rarity of diamonds, so I think they're they're pretty decently rare. And I'm not going to get a good photo of that at all, so we're going to pick him up at 201. That's massive. Coming in at 191 is the diamond, so wow, look at what an animal. That is amazing. Look at those horns. That is insane.
I had no clue that this was going to be a diamond. I'm running through trying to get compilation, like little things of just quadriculitis trophies, just trying to get, you know, all the ibexes, you know, species here and there. Oh my goodness. I didn't even know that. That was complete guesswork. I saw it as level four, I was like, that's a nice one, that'll be a good one to take. Wow, I think, I could be wrong, but I feel like Southeastern, it might be Grados. It might be the hardest Ibex to get diamond off, but I really think it's Southeastern. Wow. That is crazy. following this track for the longest time. Oh, there he goes. No, where'd she go? That is an albino European hare, and I believe that is one of the rarest animals in the game. No. Not today, you don't. Go ahead and get that guy down. I was just... This is where we just shot that aggressive wolf at, and I believe he was the one that warning thumped. I was going to go get an outpost that's down here, and I got that guy's track. I got his disturbed vegetation. I never would have thought to track that. It's an albino, and I flipped. But just to find that, that is insane. It's a silver. I will take it. That is probably one of the rarest albinos in the game. That is crazy. What is up with these spawns right now? That is a guaranteed, I believe, a guaranteed diamond wild boar. And that is the biggest estimate I have ever seen on a level 5 wild boar. He's either going to hit just low of that, or he could stand a chance at being max. I'm just running around having boar drink time because I'm bored while I'm opening up the map. Just my last kill was the albino European hare. And I didn't get seven millimeter bullets. We need to go get that. I can take him with the Grand Air. Do I want to? Not in the slightest. I don't want to take the time to stalk that. By the time I do, his drink time is going to be over and he's going to be gone. And there's way too much room for him to actually spook and for me to shoot high. I don't trust myself with it. However, I will bring, just in case, let me get more, because I need to get more 22 Hornet bullets as well. This is insane. I'll bring you guys back, but we're actually back down there. Back for round two. He is... That's going to be him right there. I, I want to get exactly into about 150 for him. So he's right there. We're going to start slowing it up now. That's to not spook him where he fits him on that point. Yeah, there's a, another boar in between me and him. So I need to get... If I can just get up a little bit higher, I'll actually think I'll be comfortable in this distance. I think right here. Yeah, I think this is going to be our shot. He's dropping. Oh, we got him. I think that was a beautiful shot. We do have some pheasant up there yelling. Well, the odds I go when I spot that thing and it's a level 3. I kind of want to just for the odds. It's a level 2, okay. The way that this luck has been running, 
I would honestly not be surprised. Did I think I was gonna find a level 5 hog out here? No. I was just hunting them because I was like, you know what? I found a wolves, I found a bit of red deer here and there. Let me hold the boar, just so I can put the nail in the coffin on my dream zones for the most part, and I don't think we could have worked that out any better. He, <laughs> yeah, he's... That was hopefully a good shot. If I walk up and I see vital blood, and I think I do, is that vital blood? Yes, that is. Alright. We want to see 240 on the weight. Where are we at? 220. I think he just kind of barely makes it over that. Yeah, 144. So he was a guaranteed. That is a huge diamond wild boar. It's not a huge diamond, but it's a huge wild boar. That is... What a hunt. I think I'm going to hunt around on here more, but I do believe by the odds that this should be our last animal in the video. And I'm going to go meet you guys in the trophy lodge as we're putting all of these guys in. So hopefully I should see you guys there. If I come across anything else rare or diamond wise, I'll bring you guys back, but I'm not. Don't count on it. Count on seeing me in the lodge. Alright, because we are finally getting into our lodge, as you can see over here. I guess we'll start with him, he's just on first. Uh, we threw our diamond boar over right here because we can get him on a body platform. Um, next, we're moving on to our little ghost bunny over here. We've decided to just put him, I wanted to put him definitely on a full body mount. Uh, I guess really any other rabbits are full body mounts on the wall or anything, but I just like him sitting over here on the bar to greet everybody. Um, and for right now we hung up both of our Ibex on the wall until we can get them in this space with their two respective other counterparts for our Ibex Grand Slam. Um, I just, I can't, I hopped on Quattro, I was watching somebody play Quattro. I don't remember who it was, maybe it was Eyeblast Deer, I think, I think it was Strix. On um, um, Quattro, uh, Brain Fog, um, and it's tuned in. I've been doing it. I've been watching a lot of other Call of Duty streamers, I'm trying to look more into like some smaller Call of Duty streamers. I think he's around like 600 something subscribers. So, because I realize I don't watch really other than the like bigger streamers like Flinter and stunt such um and I was like thinking about that I was like wow that's oh wow oh yeah bullseye okay that was ADHD brain just kicked me out but um I don't really watch anybody else play other than big streamers and I'm like wow I'm actually a really big kind of hypocrite for that because you know I want people to watch my content as I'm trying to grow and then I can't even watch other people's and um watch their content and like their videos and subscribe and stuff so I've been trying to do that and I think it's really cool um a good idea for everyone else you know not just for me look into your smaller call of streamers because I was watching someone the other day I don't remember who um probably not good that I don't remember who but um, if I remember it, or if I find it, I'll put it right here on the screen. Um, and they taught me something I didn't know about this game. And something that I didn't, I haven't really seen any of the other bigger streamers do. And I was just like, I can't, I'm very, wow, I can't believe that. Because I thought I knew everything about this game, and apparently I didn't. But, um, yeah. You know? Yeah, I have a thing where I'm like 90% sure it's ADHD. My brain just goes, 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 and then it just train stops. I don't remember where I was going with any of this. Um, but yeah, I remember now. I did not expect this on a quadruple anything like this. Um, 
So, if you guys do want to see more of just random hunts on random maps like this, usually I go out with a purpose, but for this, this was just purely me wanting to try something new and try a map that I hadn't played in such a long time. And I really enjoyed it, so I think, because everybody's doing maps on new content, I want to do, everybody's doing maps on the new, everybody's doing new content on the new map. Um, I think I'm, like, I got sucked into doing the same thing, but really, I think I need to give some of our older maps love, so. Yeah, if you guys did enjoy, please make sure to leave a like, please subscribe, and tell me your thoughts on the bunny. Oh. I fell. Your thoughts on the little bunny over there. Because I think that's one of the top five rarest animals in the game. I mean, rarest albinos in the game, but, um, you guys let me know down in the comments. Um, and join the Discord, which will be in the description, and I will see you all in the next one. Mm -hmm.